I've been told to bounce out here and say you ain't seen nothing yet. It's very poor English. We say you haven't seen nothing yet. Or do we? In any event, to present the next award, a lady who has starred in motion pictures all over the world, become an accomplished photojournalist, and is the only lady I know who was on the cover of Life as a photographer and subject, Miss Candy Bergen. And with her, look, I know that if you repeat adjectives, you can run them into the ground. Words like talented, gifted, outstanding. But with this fella, he runs them right up into the sky. The star of Brian's song and Lady Sings the Blues, Mr. Billy D. Williams. <laughs> Well, <laughs> we're here to give the award for the best achievement in cinematography. Now, without it, there's no moving picture. In fact, there's no such thing as a moving picture. The truth is that we're really looking at still pictures, more than a thousand of them per minute. I, 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 don't, I don't want to know about that now. We have so few illusions left today. Let's not destroy this one. Magic has been an honorable craft all the way back to Merlin. It'll be magic if we get through the dialogue. Then let's honor it tonight. <laughs> the nominees for best achievement in cinematography are... Butterflies are free, Charles B. Lang. Cabaret, Jeffrey Unsworth. The Poseidon Adventure, Harold E. Stein. 1776, Harry Stradling, Jr. Travels with my aunt, or aunt, Douglas Slocum. <laughs> and the winner is... He's such a gentleman. <laughs> the winner is Jeffrey Unsworth for Cavalry. Accepting the Covenant Award for Jeffrey Unsworth and Cabaret, Miss Marisa Berenson. One of the great pleasures of working in Cabaret, who is working with the wonderful cinematographer Jeffrey Unsworth. He regrets tonight very much he cannot be here to accept this award, but expresses his gratitude for this, for this great honor. Thank you.